CPS, the bold and the beautiful, spoilers revealed that perhaps Quinn wouldn't have reacted so harshly even though she was betrayed by Eric. Eric was then married to Quinn, but secretly dated Donna. He lied to Quinn about joining the handball club, but actually went to Donna's. In the past, Quinn was very wary of Donna, and even threatened Donna not to get close to Eric. With Quinn's personality, she wouldn't be able to accept being betrayed by Eric because she worked so hard to mend this marriage. But Quinn's attitude is much different, because that's how she finds her true love. Fans feared Quinn would start a fight with Donna after learning of her affair with Eric. But fortunately, Quinn realized this was going to happen sooner or later. That is, Eric has feelings for Donna, not her, and Quinn herself has long loved someone else, not Eric. Anyway, Quinn is now Carter after Eric encouraged her to confess to him. Quinn and Donna confront each other, but everything turns out to be peaceful, and they will continue to live peacefully as if nothing happened. It seems that lately the three Logan sisters have a lot of problems to deal with. Most of them are related to romance. First, Donna, who's in a relationship with Eric. Although she he is a married man, Donna still accepts being a woman in the dark. Also happy for Donna that Eric has finally decided to end his marriage to Quinn and give Donna an official status. Brooke and Ridge had a disagreement, but in the end the two got back together. They are in the process of rebuilding their feelings like they were in the beginning. I hope that after this storm is over, the two of you can get to know each other better. The most concerned right now is probably Katie. She's still alone. Katie and Bill have had arguments in the past, but until now, they still can't talk to each other normally. Perhaps Katie could not accept the mistakes that Bill made. Even if the two of them have a child together, Katie accepts to raise the baby alone, not wanting to contact Bill. Bill also tried many times to get a chance from Katie, but she still couldn't forget the hurt that Bill had brought to her. Looks like Katie will need some time to calm down. That way she could think about giving Bill another chance. Bill currently lives alone, so Wyatt and Liam are also extremely worried. At Bill's age, at least he must have a wife or friends by his side to reduce loneliness. But what Wyatt and Liam don't know how to deal with is that Bill doesn't have anyone he can talk to and keep company with. Before, Bill and Justin were very close, but after one time, Justin also did bad things to Bill. Bill was extremely angry and determined to cut off his longtime friendship with Justin. Now what Wyatt and Liam need to think about is helping their father out of his lonely situation.